Hello, everyone. I'm Kimberly Daggerhart, Director of Communications here at Educational Partners International, and welcome to today's webinar, Teaching in the USA with EPI. Before we get started, I'd like to go over a few items so you know how to participate in today's event. You'll have the opportunity to submit questions by typing your questions into the comment box at any time during the presentation. We'll collect these and address them at the end. I'd like to now introduce our presenter, Jessica White, our content specialist here at EPI. Hi everyone, my name is Jessica and I work as a content specialist for EPI, as Kimberly mentioned. Um, I'm from the mountains of North Carolina and before working for EPI, I actually taught English at the community college level. And I'm really excited to have a job that combines my passion for education with my passion for cultural exchange. So today I will be talking to you about what EPI does and how you can apply. Today's webinar is a general introduction to EPI. By the end of this presentation, we hope you will understand the mission of EPI and know the benefits both in program and after you leave the US. We will also answer any questions that you have about the program. The first question that most people have is, what is EPI? So you can answer this question in a lot of ways, but first and foremost, EPI is a cultural exchange program that brings international teachers into the U.S. to teach. Officially, EPI is designated by the U.S. Department of State as a sponsor for an exchange visitor program. We have become a world leader in cultural exchange, helping hundreds of teachers from around the world come to the U.S. to teach. Teachers in our program are currently teaching in North Carolina, South Carolina, and Florida. While we work with schools across the southern United States, our office is in North Carolina, which is about where the arrow is on the map there. We would love to know where you are from too, so go ahead and tell us in the comments. To understand the importance of U.S. cultural exchange, you may want to know more about the history of cultural exchange in the United States. Much of the cultural exchange movement in the U.S. was started by Senator J. William Fulbright. He was passionate about strengthening U.S. international relations and saw cultural exchange as a good way to accomplish this. You're probably familiar with his name because he created the Fulbright Program, which is a famous international education scholarship. After creating the Fulbright Program, he developed and passed the Fulbright-Hayes Act of 1961. The purpose of this act was to increase mutual understanding between the people of the United States and the people of other countries by means of educational and cultural exchange to strengthen the ties which unite us with other nations. The Fulbright-Hayes Act led to the creation of cultural exchange programs across the U.S., including ours. If you've been on our website, you have probably seen this definition for EPI. Educational Partners International is an exchange visitor program authorized to sponsor teachers for K-12 placement in public, private, and charter schools in North Carolina, South Carolina, and Florida. But what does that actually mean? Well, as we've already stated, it means that we offer cultural exchange opportunities for teachers from other countries to come to the United States. Cultural exchange means that our teachers come to the United States to share their culture and then return to their home country so that they can share what they have learned about the U.S. Our program is a three-year program. After those three years, you could possibly apply for up to a two-year extension, which means that the longest you will stay in the United States with us is five years. After you have finished the program, you will return to your home country for two years. Those two years where you go back home are important because that is where you are really going to complete our cultural exchange mission. Of course, we want to help you come to the U.S. to share your culture, but we are also interested in you returning home and sharing your experience in the United States with other people in your home country. That is because EPI believes sharing knowledge across cultures and venues improves understanding among teachers, students, administrators, and members of the communities in which we live. This is the whole reason why we do this program. 
your ability to bring your culture to the United States and then to take United States culture back home with you is really what true cultural exchange is about, exchanging knowledge and information between cultures so that we can understand each other better as a global community. So what does this kind of cultural exchange look like? Well, as a teacher with EPI, you will create projects and events to help share some of your culture with students and teachers in the U.S. Today, we have a couple of examples of teacher projects our teachers have done in the past. An EPI teacher from Chile had her students write a book entirely in Spanish. The book was called Changing the World, and they were later able to publish it. Here you can see them reading it, as well as some of the illustrations they drew for it. Here is an event hosted by one of our Filipina teachers. She made a traditional festival float to display outside her classroom. She also shared traditional foods and crafts. Here's an event that a couple of our Jamaican teachers did together. For this event, they made Jamaican food. They also taught traditional dances to the students and teachers at the school. One of our teachers from Ecuador gave her students traditional Ecuadorian food and taught them a traditional dance after telling them about life in her home country. We also have a video of Claudia from Mexico's cultural exchange of event. Here is how Claudia shared her culture with her school. Today is May 10. May 10 in Mexico, it's a really big celebration. It's Mother's Day and for us, mothers are like the base of the family. So at school, what I try to do is just to share my culture and share the way we celebrate in Mexico here. The kids were really excited. They were happy to be able to sing to their moms. They were happy to be able to express their feelings. And for the American moms, they can learn about our culture, the way that we celebrate. I think every single mom like and enjoy this event. As you can see, we provide many opportunities for you to share your culture here with your school in the United States, and there are many different ways that you can do this. You will have the ability to find what you are really passionate about and share that with your students. Now that you have more of a background on who we are and what we do, it's time to talk about what benefits you will get from participating in our program. As we keep talking about, the most obvious benefit is that you will get to encounter new cultural experiences, experience life in the U.S., and share your culture with people who would not normally experience it. Your students here may not know very much at all about life in your home country, and you will get to share things with your students that they would have never known otherwise. By doing this, you also have the opportunity to make a positive impact for students all over the world, not just in your home country. Also, one of the most important things that we offer you is professional and personal support for you during your time here in the United States. We think teacher support is a major part of this whole process and one of the most important things that we do. We are invested in your success, so we are available as a resource for you even after you arrive in the U.S. So let's talk more in depth about the type of support that we offer our teachers. EPI's support program is an area of pride for us as a cultural exchange program. As soon as you are placed in a school, one of our dedicated and trained support team members will contact you to help guide you in the process of moving to the U.S. The relationship between you and the support team is an important one and will continue throughout your time as an EPI program member. Should you need help of any kind while you are in the U.S., the EPI support team is ready to help. At EPI, we understand that American students need the international perspective that teachers like you bring, and we are dedicated in doing all we can to help you deliver it. EPI is a program that not only provides benefits while you are here, but also when you return to your home country. The experiences and professional development that you will have while in the U.S. is something that you will carry with you your whole life. 
Once you are done with our program, you will be able to go home with a new perspective that will enrich your personal and professional life. Also, participating in this program means that you are now a world educator. You are a teacher who has taught students from multiple countries all over the world. Experiences like these are truly life-changing, and you will not be the same kind of teacher or person that you were before you came here, which we consider to be one of the major benefits of participating in our program. Before we finish talking about the benefits that EPI has to offer, here is what some of our teachers have to say about their time in the United States. Lynn from Australia had a great experience with EPI. She said, being in the EPI program has given me the opportunity to meet people from all over the world and to learn about their culture and language. It has been challenging at times, but it's allowed me to grow as a person and step out of my comfort zone. Henry from Jamaica says, my experience thus far has been challenging but rewarding. EPI makes a deliberate effort to match teachers with schools that best fit their strengths. Because of EPI, I find that my professional growth in the U.S. is nurtured daily by a supportive school administration. We also have a video of several of our teachers from the Philippines telling their stories of teaching in the United States. After this brief video, we will be answering your questions in a live question and answer session. So this is what they say about their experience with EPI. I came to the United States not just to teach, but to make a difference in American students' lives. When my friends told me about the EPI program to become the cultural ambassador as an exchange teacher here, oh, it sounds like, oh, I want to try it. Basically, I joined EPI because um, I've always had passion for cultural exchange. For me, uh, teaching is the most enjoyable and the most effective way of changing the world. It's a, it's a give and take um, learning. I don't only learn, they don't only learn from me, but I also learn from them. I feel honored and excited to be the cultural ambassador of the Philippines to the U.S. in the field of education. The reason why I, I joined EPI is because it's my childhood dream to teach in the United States. Uh, we are happy because the EPI gave us this opportunity to serve the American kids and to share our culture to them. It took me a long time to fulfill my American dream and it was because of EPI. I will also have the opportunity to share this passion with everybody and hopefully make a difference in my students' journey to success. They told me, you are the only Asian person here. And I told them, all right, this Asian person will make change on you. So one of my students, I, I, I heard that uh, she uh, applied for an exchange student in the Philippines. She said that, you know what, I am very curious of what I have just saw in your video. So with the support of Filipino teachers and also other EPI teachers that are coming from other countries, you will really feel like everything is really um, worth doing as a teacher. I started uh, watching uh, the football games and all the other sports games of my students to, to, to be in a community where I belong. The community was very supportive. It's not only the school, but also some of the churches. They come together to help me put out my house. They put together furniture. And we're so proud because me and my wife teaching together, sharing everything to the kids, to the American kids, and at the same time, we're learning also their culture. We both know that when we work together towards a common goal, we can make it. We can make it happen. To hear more from our teachers, visit our Facebook page. We have posted several videos of our teachers talking about their cultural exchange experiences. We also post teacher stories on our website, teachwithepi.com. Now it is time for our question and answer session. I will be answering any questions that you have left in the comments. So if you have not yet submitted your questions, please ask them now. We also encourage you to tell us about yourself. We would love to know where you are from and what you are currently teaching. I'm joined again by Kimberly, who has collected questions, you, the questions that you've submitted during the presentation. Hey, Hi. Jessica. Hi, Kimberly. And hello to all the teachers joining us from around the world today. 
We'd like to welcome teachers from Jamaica, the Philippines, Mexico, Argentina, and lots of other places. Thanks so much for tuning in today. All right, Jessica, the first question today comes from a teacher in the Philippines who asks, does your program have an age limit? Uh, that's a great question. That's one of our most common questions, actually. And the answer is no, we do not have an age limit. Regardless of how old you are, as long as you meet our other eligibility requirements, you can apply at teachwithepi.com. All right, great. The next question we have is, are you looking for music teachers? Yes, uh, we do place music teachers. We place teachers in all subjects that we teach in the United States. So uh, yeah, we do place music teachers. Okay, the next question that we have is, can my family join me? Yes, we do sponsor J-2 visas. You will have to consider, you know, the whether or not you'll be able to financially support your whole family in the United States, but you can bring your family with you. We will sponsor J-2 visas. For our next question, someone asks, do I have to be a native English speaker? So the answer is no. Native English speaker would mean that English is your first language, and English does not have to be your first language. However, you will need to have strong English speaking skills to participate in this program. Got it. So our next question is, can I apply now for next year? And I think what they mean by that is 2019. Okay, yes, so right now we are accepting applications for the 2019-2020 school year. So all of our applicants that are applying now will be considered for the 2019-2020 school year. All right, and our last question that we'll be taking live, is there an application or placement fee? Uh, no, there is no application fee. There are some documents that you will need to get when you are doing your application, such as the criminal record check or the certified translations that will cost money for you to obtain, but EPI will never charge you an application fee. That's our last question for today. If you didn't get to ask your question, go ahead and leave it in the comments. We'll answer all remaining questions in the comments right after the broadcast. Thanks so much for joining us today. Thanks for having me, Jessica. Okay, so now that you know more about us, the question is, is EPI right for you? Here we have listed some of the basic requirements for our program. EPI teachers must have a bachelor's degree. They must have at least two years full-time teaching experience. They must be currently teaching and they must have advanced English skills. So if that sounds like it applies to you, apply at teachwithepi.com. As you can see in the video, the first step is to go to our website, teachwithepi.com teachers. Once you are there, you will scroll down until you see the orange button that says click here to apply. Then you will answer some questions about your eligibility and click the submit button. After you answer the questions, you will then be able to make an account with your email address and start your application. An email address is all you need to get started. If you have already started the application process, be sure you are checking your email regularly for updates on your status. In closing today, I would like to share this quote from J. William Fulbright that I feel illustrates the importance of cultural exchange education. He says, we must try to expand the boundaries of human wisdom, empathy, and perception, and there is no way of doing that except through education. Much like Fulbright talks about here, at EPI we hope to expand the understanding of U.S. students by giving them the opportunity to learn from teachers like you. Okay, that's all for today, everybody. If you are interested in viewing our previous webinars or signing up for our upcoming webinars, go to teachwithepi.com slash webinars and sign up for our mailing list. Also, be sure to follow us on Facebook to hear about our upcoming events, as well as to hear more from our current teachers. If you have any more questions, be sure to email us at team at teachwithepi.com. On behalf of everyone at EPI, thanks for joining us and have a great day.